And KCAL is kicking off our Chips for Kids toy drive where we help the CHP brighten the holidays for some kids in need. KCAL's Amber Lee joins us with information on how you can help donate a toy. Amber. Hi, Rude Bay. Hi, Marcy. All right, so we are so festive here and we are with our old friends, the CHP, to kick off 35 years of chips for kids and it just gets bigger and bigger every year. I'm here with Officer April Elliott. April, please tell us about this year because I know it's going to be huge. Yes, absolutely. This year we're really excited to be starting earlier, actually two weeks earlier. That's going to give us a time extension and be able to get more toys donated and collected and that way we can give more toys out. So that's what I'm really looking forward to. Are we hitting any particular community this year? differently than the years past? So a lot of times different is, what we're doing different is that we're starting earlier yes. and any of the toys that we collect in those communities actually go back to those communities. So that's what's so great about this. Oh, I love that. Toy drive. And also not just for kids, teenagers. We always have to emphasize because yes. sometimes we forget about the teenagers. Yes, absolutely. So um, teenagers, are, we often forget it's so fun to pick out toys for the little ones, yeah. but you can also pick toys for teenagers, gift cards, sports equipment, stuff like that. Okay, so I know there's a goal this year. Last year, how many toys did you collect? So we collected almost 80,000 toys last year, and we want to hit that 100,000. <gasps> 100,000 or more. Yes. No, we have to do it. Yes. <laughs> That's uh, the goal. Okay, and so we have various drop-off locations. Yes. And you're also going to be at the Chargers game uh, in December as well, collecting. Yes, on December 10th, Sunday, we'll be at the Chargers game along with our other live remote locations. But come drop off a toy, come visit, say hi. All right, so here's a look on your full screen. In front of your uh, TV screen, we have various locations around Southern California. You can drop off a toy or, again, gift cards for the teens uh, at the Citadel in Los Angeles, the Lakewood Center Mall, Westfield Mall, Culver City, Walmart in West Palmdale on 10th Street, Sam's Club on 10th Street, also in West Palmdale, and, of course, the place that we've gone a number of years, and I've been there, and one of my favorite memories, the West Coast uh, Plaza, um, West Covina Plaza, uh, a family came, they had three kids, they came with a truckload of their own toys from under the tree and they just donated everything because the kids said they didn't need it. That's so amazing. That's one of my favorite memories. Yeah. All right, you have time, so yes. go out, find what you need and come help us donate to make that 100,000 yes. donation mark. Mm -hmm. Helping to spread some holiday cheer by collecting toys for some kids in need. Our Chips for Kids toy drive has brought smiles to thousands of young faces, and you can help make that possible again this year. KCAL's Kalina Estrinos joins us now to tell us how. Hey, Kalina. Hey, guys. So, you know, I love to have fun, and so I figured I'd find a tricycle <laughs> to show you how much fun it is to be a kiddo and why you should donate. So, um, I found a bike finally that fits me. Take a look. This will hopefully go to a a wonderful kiddo in need in the local community and say hi to my friend Sydney. Hi. She is here with us from Athens Services and I said hey pick a toy that you know how to use and she picked the basketball. There you go. See <laughs> we're clearly adults but we know how to have fun right and it's all about the holidays it's all about giving back and your company has actually been a part of this for a couple years mm. so tell me why it's so important for you guys to make sure um, kids have a bright and merry holiday. Absolutely so at Athens and services. We are a privately owned waste hauler here in Southern California and we treat our residents and our customers like family and we want to make sure that children and teens in need this year are treated like family. So tell me a little bit about what it's like for you guys to see the look on the kids faces when they get these toys. Oh it's magical. I mean Every week when our haulers, uh, the, the drivers come by and they pick up trash, the kids just absolutely love it. So to, instead of pick up, we give back this year. We, we love seeing it. Their faces are just magical. And I know you guys sometimes bring out a surprise, this trash truck or this mini truck yeah, I've heard about. Yeah. Are we thinking we might have that out this year? So yeah, at some of our locations, we will have trash trucks. They're, uh, kids love the trash trucks and we're, we're happy to be there with them. It's exciting. I love it. So if there's one thing you can tell people at home to get them excited, to get them to want to give back, because we know it's been such a tough past couple of years, right? Yeah. And we've been mentioning this all morning. Inflation, gas prices, rent increases. I mean, everyone is kind of struggling right now. So this is a great way to just give back. Absolutely. 
you know, it's it's a fun time of year and it's an even more fun time to talk some trash with some kiddos and, <laughs> and give away some toys. I love it. Okay, we have the drop up locations on your screen. We have been a part of this for over 30 years. We are so excited. You have the Citadel outlet area. You got Lakewood Center Mall. You got Westville Mall in Culver City. Walmart over on 10th Street, Palmdale, Sam's Club. That's over on 10th Street, Palmdale as well, and Plaza West Covina. We're going to have fun with this throughout the next couple of weeks and leading up to Christmas, which is so exciting. So stick with us. I'm going to be talking to more people, getting you excited, and we're going to be playing some basketball, working on our <laughs> skills. Yeah, I was I was point guard in seventh grade, and that was the extent of my basketball career. So I'll give it to you, Sydney, <laughs> and I'll send it back to you guys in the studio. Happy holidays, by the way. Happy holidays, Kalita, and you still have those basketball skills Thanks, and those girl. little <laughs> tricycle riding skills, too. <laughs> CBS News Los Angeles, your local news, streaming wherever, whenever.